There's a, an egg, an apple. There's all kinds of things that you can dangle. Hi, BravoTV.com. I'm Sutton. Welcome to my house. Y'all come on in and let's take a look. So this is my living room. This room is the heart of the house to me. You know, we love to just sit here and have cocktails and listen to the piano. My kids take piano lessons and I play the piano as well. And I have like local artists from Augusta that are on the walls and stuff so it reminds me of home and it kind of looks a little southern to me so I just love it. Let me show you the dining room. It's right off my living room. I love this dining room so much. This table is from New Orleans from the 1800s. Again, my southern roots are kind of coming out and I truly think that this wood speaks to me and brings out my southern vibes. We do big dinners here like Christmas and Thanksgiving and I do love to cook. It's very convenient because the kitchen's right here if you want to come in into the kitchen. I think like most homes all over the world, this is where we are the most. My kids do homework right here at this table every day. And then we have the sitting room over here so the TV can be going on and we can sit, run the fire, the dogs are over in this area. So this is a populated geographic area in the house. So as much as I love food and cooking, I know that you are probably like all of my other friends. You wanna come up and see my room. The master bedroom. This room is my quiet place. I like to work at my desk here. I like to sit in bed and watch TV, which no one ever admits that they do, but we all watch TV and that's my favorite pastime. And turn my fireplace on and the cats come get in the bed with me. My kids will get in the bed with me sometimes and we'll watch a movie. So it's just a quiet, it's a very quiet place. We can go check out the pool in the backyard. It's kind of special. The pool. We are here almost every weekend. It's a great thing about living in Bel Air, living in LA. We get the sun almost all year round. My kids love it here. I just had the seventh grade back to school party and had 25 kids in this pool playing volleyball in the grass. It's just really, it's about family and friends and fun and relaxation. It's where we decompress on the weekends. So thank y'all for coming in and checking things out here. I'm gonna actually go for school pickup and I hope y'all have a great day or evening and see you soon. Hi, bravotv.com. This is Sutton Strack. I'm with the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. And if you want to get to know me better, you've come to the right place. This is my closet where all of my stories have unfolded over many, many years. And I think the best place to start is definitely with my shoes. My Brian Atwoods, these are great. Brian is a really good friend of mine. I love these shoes. And like he signed the bottom for me because he's so sweet. Okay, these shoes are hilarious because Louboutin is known for not wearing, having comfortable shoes and these are not comfortable. These are called trash shoes, but they are hilarious. He did things that like, I think he, I think he took things off of his floor that he actually used for other shoes and started making trash shoes. They're iconic. But then I also love my sneaks. I'm from Augusta. We go to the Augusta National for the Masters Tournament every year. These are for next year, spring 2020, to wear to the tournament. So they're, they're cute and fun. My tiaras I'm sort of obsessed with. Thank you, Mr. Dolce and Mr. Gabbana for starting this fetish of mine. The great thing about tiaras is if you're having a bad hair day or you're feeling sad, totally fixes everything right here. Just put a tiara on, it's good, you're good to go. This is my new Louis Vuitton bag and this is by Urs Fischer. He is an artist and did a collection with Louis Vuitton and so there's a box of different vegetables that you can hang. There's a carrot, there's a, an egg, an apple, there's all kinds of things that you can dangle. You can also dangle them from the bottom. I have not, she has not come out with me yet, but I mean, she's kind of cute with this outfit. So I do have to keep a little tiny ladder in this closet. Um, one, my housekeeper, she's smaller than I am, so she definitely needs it. But um, we use this to step up, because these are more like my cocktail dresses, so I don't wear them all the time. 
but this is kind of a fun dress too. Sorry, I hate to bring up Dolce & Gabbana again, but I did wear this exact dress on the runway in Milan when I walked the fashion show, and I've never worn it since. There's actually another little closet situation that I want to show you. My hats are really fun. This is couture. It's um, Dolce & Gabbana Altimoda. And I bought this a couple of years ago. And it's this cashmere ship dress, and I love it. And it's so pretty. And you know what's great about this dress? And what's great about a lot of the Dolce & Gabbana Altimoda pieces that I buy? They're actually from the runway. And I love when things can zip up. It makes me so happy. Like, a model wore this, and then I wore it. Love it. This is it. This is my closet. C'est moi et c'est tout. Eventually, I would like to take this wall down and blend all of this together to live happily ever ever as a family. And I hope y'all can see that later and stay tuned maybe for the reconstruction of the closet. So this will all be a big open space with everybody together. All my memories, all my favorites together. Thanks for watching. See you later.